This phrase you use that Cherry crawls into the character in ways you don't expect. Is that a good way of describing how an actor approaches a role? Well, I, I think it, when something feels so far away as, as this one certainly did, and I was terrified the closer we got to the first day of rehearsal, I thought, I am out of my mind if I think <laughs> I'm going to get away with this. Mm -hmm. But you, <clears throat> I, I know that I, what I do is I sometimes try to build myself a physical home. Mm -hmm. I, I, if I build the house, then maybe someone will move in, you mm -hmm. know? Mm -hmm. And so I, I do start, uh, it, both physically and emotionally, together, but I'm very, very conscious of, of, the, of the temple of the character and the speech and the rhythms and the, uh, I mean, it's all there. Mm -hmm. I mean, I knew as a Tennessee Methodist when I read that play that they had to be from the Bronx. Mm -hmm. and, and I don't, uh, and I was of course hoping that maybe they weren't, didn't really have to be from the Bronx. <laughs> when he said that they did, yeah. and I thought, of course, it's going to make it so much more rich, and, and you're going to be able to smell everything that much more. And uh, so uh, the Bronx accent, which this one has mastered, Mr. <laughs> Mr. Ireland over here, yeah. uh, yeah. it was a real challenge for, for those of us in the play who've never done a Bronx accent before. <laughs>